Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Welcome back. Today we are going to be filming our first vlog. Yes, first vlog. Our first vlog, and it's going to be an exciting one because we're hiking for yes. the first time. And so we wanted to take you guys with us. Yes, and it's supposed to be a waterfall today, but we will see. Yes. It's probably about almost an hour away from our apartment. Yeah, so we're already here, and yes. we're going to take you guys with us. We have Milo in the back. He is. <laughs> yeah. He's tired. He just woke up from a nap, yep, so we'll see did. how he is. Yep, so we'll see you guys in a minute. Yep. All right, guys, so we're about to go up this big yes. hill to get to the waterfall. We can already hear it right here. You yeah, can I can see a little. Yeah. We are almost to the top now. Yeah, he's pulled us up the whole way. Yes, so. he's excited. Yeah. We can still see. It's so beautiful. So pretty. We're halfway there. Yes, almost there. Almost there. We keep getting told by everyone how beautiful it is. Yeah, it's so getting, it's getting a lot louder too. Yep. So we're close. Yeah, so we'll see you guys in a yes. second. Oh, so this is the waterfall. So here it is. Here it is. Here's a waterfall. So pretty. And that is where we came from. So beautiful. So we just got here. So beautiful. So beautiful. It All right, everybody, we just made it to the waterfall. Yes, we did. There it is. It's so beautiful. Milo got a little bit yeah, scared, Milo, though. He, he escaped his harness. Yeah, he escaped his harness that he is on. And so it scared us pretty bad. So we think we're about to leave in a minute. All right, guys, we are back in the car now. Yeah, we just made it back to the car. Someone got out of their harness. Milo. Yes, I think he was scared of the noise. I don't know, it was really loud. And there was some people around. Yes, and. So we made it all the way to the top of the waterfall, as you guys saw. Yes. And we stopped recording, and then all of a sudden. I, I heard something like hit the ground, and it was, uh, like you know the metal thing you hook in your harness yeah yeah that hit the ground and then i see milo without his harness and he's trying to back up i guess he's trying to run away from the waterfall yeah it really scared us and so that's yes. when we were like it's it's time to go yes and he was like not shaking but he was you can tell he's ready to go yeah definitely no he was ready it, i mean it was a lot for him this was his it first was. time ever and we forgot his hiking boots so <laughs> i bought him some hiking boots and i forgot them at yes. home so now i feel bad oh Yes, he's, it was just, he's very spoiled. He was he, very scared, but I'm glad he's okay. Yeah. And so now we are going to do what? Now we are going back to the apartment and maybe going out for dinner tonight. Yes. Or so, Bella's going to make dinner. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. Um, and we're going to vlog it. Yes. So you guys will see what we do. We will see you then. Yep. Hey guys. So as you can see, we are home now. We came home and we got cleaned up, showered, changed our clothes and everything. And now Milo and Gunnar are taking a nap because they both got up really early and they're both really tired. So while they're taking a nap, I'm gonna go ahead and get dinner prepared for us. And I wanted to walk you guys through what I make and how I make it. And it's super easy what we're having tonight. So anyone can make it. It's really not for experts or anything cause I'm definitely not an expert. So let's get started. All right, so here I have our cut chicken. We just have a few chicken breasts in here that we cut up into small pieces for tonight's meal. I'm actually gonna prepare a spicy honey chicken. It's really delicious and there's only a few ingredients needed for it, so let's get started. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and start off by showing you guys the three ingredients I use in my honey spicy chicken. So the first ingredient is any type of oil. I believe this is olive oil. I'm not sure, it doesn't matter, anything works. The next ingredient is honey, obviously, honey spicy chicken. 
And then any type of Cajun seasoning. It doesn't have to be this type, but this type is really, really good. So those are literally the three ingredients. That is it. And it's so good. So let me go ahead and show you guys what I do. All right, so here's our cut up chicken breast and we took the fat off of it for the most part as much as we could and so now all you have to do is add your ingredients. You really don't have to cut it up like this but Gunnar and I just like it like that. So all you have to do is add a little bit of that and then a little bit of Cajun seasoning. You could add as much or as little as you'd like of this, se of this seasoning or any of these ingredients depending on how spicy you want it. If you want it a little bit spicier, add more spice to it. If you want it a little bit sweeter, add more honey to it. So next, all you gotta do is add your honey. All right, so now you add your honey. I like it a little bit sweeter, but Gunnar likes it a little bit spicier, so I try to even it out pretty much a lot. And so now what you're going to do is you're going to go ahead and mix this all up. So I will show you guys what it looks like when it's all mixed up. All right, so here is the chicken all marinated. I went ahead and added a little bit more spice and a little bit more honey. And now it is good to go. And now I'm going to go ahead and put this into the fridge for a couple hours and let it marinate. All right, so while the chicken is in the fridge marinating, I am cleaning up the potatoes. And I'm about to cut them up and prepare them to cook. Okay, so now that all the potatoes are all cut up, I am going to get started on the broccoli. And here we have the broccoli, and I'm a j just about to boil this and soften it up. And then I'm going to put it into a big pan with the potatoes, and I'll mix it up together, and I'll let it cook. Gunnar and I like our things a little bit crunchy, so you may see that everything might be looking a little crunchy, but that's okay. All right, so here we have the broccoli cooking in some boiling water and we're going to let that sit until the broccoli is soft enough to be able to be cooked. So now for the potatoes I'm going to go ahead and preheat the oven to 350 and then I'm going to go ahead and put them on here with some olive oil sprinkled on top and some salt. Guess who finally got up? I am up. We It's been a couple hours now and so yes, I'm going to go ahead and cook the chicken and we have the broccoli on the stove, boiling, getting ready to soften the shoe, up. The shoe chef is here. Yes, he is. Help. Yes, he is. And we have the potatoes here put in the oven. It just has some olive oil and some salt on them. That looks very good. And then this is just boiling here with just hot water. So yeah, and yep. then we'll mix it in. Almost ready. We'll mix them together when they're done. Yeah. Okay, so now that the chicken is done, I'm gonna go ahead and put it on here in a pan. You don't need to put anything in the pan, it's okay. And then you're just gonna go ahead and let that cook as long as you would like. We make it extra crunchy. Yes, That's I a, like mine crunchy. Sorry, yeah, so we just really like our food extra crunchy. So we'll just let that sit for a little. All right, guys, here's the finished product. It is done. It is done. And it smells so good. Yes, it does. I'm ready. The broccoli and potatoes is one of those things that doesn't look that good. Yes, but, but it's so good. It tastes wonderful. It smells so good. So we're going to go ahead and dig in. Yes. All right. You guys seriously have to try this. It's some of the best chicken I've ever had in my life. Ooh, thank you. Pat on my shoulder. Pat on my shoulder. Dinner was so good. It was delicious, and we hope you guys try it. Yes, we do. It was really good. Tag us if you do. Uh, but we're going to actually end the vlog here. Yep, and end it here. Yep, we're going to enjoy a nice movie together. Yes, we are. And just hang out, and we aren't really doing anything else. So Nope, we will <laughs> see you next time. Thank you very much for your view. Yeah, thank you for your view. See you guys next see you. time.